would like to bring up the eaters, if we can. We're going to bring up the female eaters, and then we're going to bring up the male eaters. Female and male eaters weren't just brought up separately at the annual weigh-in held every year before the Nathan's 4th of July International Hot Dog Eating Contest. They will also be competing separately for the first time at the actual event. This year, Nathan's has created a distinct category of competition for the greatest female eaters of the world. For the first time ever, women will compete in their own contest in Coney Island with a purse of $20,000. I believe that that will help usher women into the final stage of gender equality and it is an honor to work with those ladies and we thank them for their service. The competitive eating contestants were divided on the new women's category. Joey Chestnut, who set the world record of 68 hot dogs in 10 minutes, thought it was a great idea. I think the women's category is awesome. Sonia Thomas, she's a champion. She's a wonderful eater. She deserves to get a title at eating hot dogs. She's a... Uh, and, and, and I think it's going to draw more, hopefully it'll attract more women into the sport. I don't believe that there's any, any physical reason that they can't be just as successful as us. Their bodies are meant to, to accommodate kids, you know, their ribs stretch, their abs stretch. We don't have that advantage, so uh, I think we should be eating together. Sonia Black Widow Thomas, the presumed front runner to win the women's championship, was happy for the shot at a title. This year is very, very exciting too, because I never, I never can get the yellow mustard bag, like a bag, champion bag because of the men. But this year, is I can have my own belt. In the past, it was almost impossible for a woman to make it, you know, unless you're beating out every guy at the table. Now it opens the doors for not the average woman, because average women don't do this, but you know, for women to get in. This is Will Poulos for NYPost.com.